Charlie Cannons, Charlie Cannons, boom, 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 we are not pirates. Hello and welcome back, everyone, to another exciting episode of the Charlie Cannons Rocket League Boom Season. Boom. <laughs> the season of boom. <laughs> Well, if uh, the rules are, if one of us gets boomed in the middle of a game by the computer opponents, we must uh, sit out of the game until one of our teammates booms one of them back. Boom. So, extra difficulty. It's already, it's obviously the reason we lost that one game. Yeah, obviously, the one where obviously. No booms is the reason yeah, why. Clearly. Yes. Mm, yeah, definitely. It wasn't just bad playing. Do you guys all. know if all three of us get boomed? That oh, is just gonna be like. It's gonna be bad news. It's gonna, it's gonna suck just watching the other team score. Do you on us. think it will happen get, at some just, point this season? I don't know, but that just means we lose. Pretty yeah. much, yeah. 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 Unless well, we were already like, winning. Like and winning we by like oh, such a rate. Yeah. That, that would, would be hilarious. spectacular. That would be weird. Sit there and watch and see if they can. It, yeah, it's like, yeah. can they get seven goals get back seven on goals us? To the I think the minutes. answer is if you are the only remaining person on the team, you have to prioritize booming people. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Sure. I mean, if you're, cause, because as soon, even when one person is down, that needs to be a priority because otherwise you're dangerously close to being in like a, you know, QB3 situation yeah. all yeah. of a sudden. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Anyway, let's get our uh, game underway against the Bombers. The Bombers worry me. You know, they, they're they no, they're known boomers. Yeah. Well, it's right in the name. Yeah, yeah it's right, right, the name. right there. So we shall see. We shall see. Whew. Boy, oh boy. Here we go. Manfield. I did not realize, but this stadium has a whole bunch of international flags all around it. Oh, interesting. So it does. Because I'm not playing, I actually have the ability to look at the stadium. <laughs> to, to, to look at the nutball. <laughs> take, yeah. in, take in the spaces, the sights, the sounds, mm -hmm. the smells. Center ball. The smells. Um, oh, it's gonna! Oh my! Oh, oh wow! My gosh. Hey, you scored, Ben. Good job. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, with the score, I look believe. Look at this! Look at that! It was like a I double whip. I came from score. downtown like, that's the, that's and the just shot. whipped. Yeah, right his, there. And I'm like, Derek, I did not even hit the wall. Oh, oh, it kept oh. ricocheting off. That's hilarious. How oh man, that's so bad. Counted either way. That's Counted right. Either way. Boom. Our first question today is from Max O. Uh, Max says, hey, Jordan, and everyone else. Okay, uh, listen here now. <laughs> hey, they, 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 they know, how, like, they know, they I know how they got this question on the show. Uh -huh. It's also a pretty good question. Uh, he says, I've had trouble making friends in high school as a freshman. I've considered starting a club Oops. for something I really enjoy. Uh, the school has given some backlash, but I was considering going for it regardless. Uh, should I try and start a club for an Overwatch right. League? Or should I keep trying to make friends, quote, the normal way? Um, I've already joined a sports team and a couple of other clubs, but I really haven't made any friends. Also, please don't tell me to join the Discord. I have online friends already, but I'm tired of sitting alone at lunch. Um, well, first off, join the Discord. Yeah. yeah. First of all, uh, you just asked for that one. Yeah. 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 Um, but anyway, um, so for, for clarity, um, boom! Boom, boom, we are not pirates. Um, is Overwatch, like, it's a video game, right? It's I meant you were talking about Overwatch being the video so. game. And not literally in, the act of Overwatch. Yeah. I'm starting a lookout club. Um, <laughs> For the school, yeah. This is, it's like Nightwatch. Tomorrow. <laughs> Tomorrow night. Right now, we're oh boy. back. Yeah. Jay, Jay, it's yours. Ace, Ace. Giggles. Yes. Whoop, 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 whoop. What's up? Guys, this could be the episode where we get all three boomed. And, and we have to wait. We have to <laughs> we have to sit and wait. Yeah. I like how we're playing ghosts too. This is the team with the ghost names. Yeah, uh, yeah. Do you think the thing that they're called bombers and then they have ghost names because the idea is that they all died in a bomb or something? Uh, that would be well, it's like what's the lore behind the team name here? I don't know. That that should that could just be a channel. It's literally just, what is the Rock, lore behind... Rocket League lore! Yeah. <laughs> Rocket League. Heavily storyline game. Uh, <laughs> Immensive world building. It's like, uh, <laughs> you don't necessarily see it if you're the the average gamer, but... but yeah, if you look deep enough, you it's will like find James meaning. Oh, man. Oh, come on, um, Derek. Okay, so this is this is the question about... Oh! No! oh okay. Oh, oh, wow. All right, so the question about starting a club. Um, this is one of those things where, like, the school is... Discouraging somebody starting a club, that just seems short sighted. Yeah, what kind of school like, is this? It's, it is a literal crime to ever like discourage enthusiasm about anything. It's like, right. if, oh. if you see somebody who's enthusiastic and you make fun of them or anything for it, you are like, You're the worst. The worst. Yeah. The Unless bottom of the barrel. Yeah. Oh man. Because um, that's, that's just one of those things where it's like, enthusiasm, as the world of the internet has shown us, 
uh, can can breed a successful career in any capacity. Ooh. Oh, oh, my God. Ooh, that was lucky. And even if it doesn't become your job, it can bring you happiness, and There's that's that too. good too. Right, right. Um, uh, that being said, if it's an Overwatch League, like, I feel like all you need to do is find other people that are good at Overwatch. <laughs> Um, or not good at Overwatch. Or not good but want to be. Yeah. Right, right, Or right, people right. who enjoy watching people play Overwatch, because I... I plenty of those. Yeah. You, you honestly, could, like... You could Overwatch Overwatch. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Overwatch. The Watch Watchers. The Watch <laughs> Watchers. <laughs> oh, no, I oh, missed! Get Sorry. out of the way, Samara. Sorry. Oh, boy. Samara. Um... So what's this person's question? Um, <laughs> should they start a club? Oh yes, yeah, start the, the club. Yes, but so like, do you think this is an effective way to make friends? Like, I, uh, right. I, I would say so. I mean, I mean, it, it can be. I think it really, honestly, depends on your execution. Uh, sure, club yeah. said club. I mean, shared not. interests and passions certainly are a good way to uh, garner friendships. That's a very easy thing to do. Right. Um, and I, I would say you're doing the right thing. I mean, if it's something that you show genuine enthusiasm in, I would just like wear that right on your sleeves. And I think a lot of people will, will feel it as well and also want to join up. Um, but that being said, I would also keep like very uh, realistic goals in mind where like maybe start with something super small where it's like, can you get like a, a team of Overwatch is five people? Right? Uh, six. So you'd six. be five plus the person. That's all you really okay. need. You so, don't need huge yeah. turnout. Yeah. Right, right. So the goal in the beginning should be, can you get a team of six? And then go from there. Um, and I can tell you, like, uh, we did like a Summer. land a land party here recently, uh, just with our group of friends. And I had many of many of our friends oh, message going, me yeah. and say that it was like one of the most fun things mm -hmm. that they've done. Yes. Um, you know, just just recently at all. Um, so I think that you know it can be a type of thing where if you can just get everybody there in one place. Right. Get it going. I think you probably don't want to make it seem like you're like really in it to be the best Overwatch team that ever existed. Yeah, right. don't put pressure on people. Don't put really. pressure. Yeah, just be like, just, just, we're just here to have fun and play video games after school at school because you know we're awesome like that. You know what I think he's gonna need? A really good flyer for the club. A good flyer. Yeah, like oh. something that you can post up to to advertise for it all around the school and stuff. Because like. Man. This, Oh, or, or, or marketing. Or, I was like, there's wow, only one yeah, flyer just, in the game. What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah. <laughs> I have never played Overwatch, yeah. nor have Looking I watched Jordan, anyone play Overwatch. Grassroots marketing. Oh, oh man. Ooh, that boy. being said, there you, was one time in uh, high school where a girl on our cross country team, it was her birthday, and we literally printed off flyers and put them on every single locker uh, that said happy birthday. Yeah. And you know what? Effective. Everyone knew it was her birthday. <laughs> <laughs> That's effective. That's right. There's. There's so many places to put flyers. You know, all you have to do is just do, yeah, just go do that. You don't need, the fun thing about this sort of stuff is you don't really have, like, probably you should ask permission, but you really don't, like, absolutely do. have to. I would uh, keep the, I would keep the flyer not, like, entirely cryptic, no! but, like, maybe where, like, if there's a question still necessary just based on what you see on the flyer. Oh my gosh, so Ben and I, fun story, um, oh no. in high school, not, re not really flyers, not advertising for anything at all. But you've heard us probably talk about the Please. Green Mallet Association, the the GMA, as it were, uh, that we just called the the group of four of us that was our friends, me, Ben, Mike, and John. We rolled and, uh, mad deep. Ooh, ooh, you know, we can almost feel the whole Overwatch League team. <laughs> uh, and so we we called ourselves the GMA, the Green Mallet Association, and we just made these little stickers. Like literally, I drew a duck in paint and. Uh, like MS Paint. Yeah, like, yeah. Like, <laughs> so yeah you I didn't mean, go around with like a uh, bottle of this paint. This is 2000. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, what are you doing? I'm duck. What are you doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> over and over and over. And I just print, we print out like 20 to a sheet of paper and cut them out and then like put scotch tape on the back. And we just put them all over the school with zero explanation at all. We just and, hid them. Oh my gosh, did it confuse people. Like, they were like, that, like I would see other people wearing them, they'd be like, "What is this?" We just shoved them in random lockers, like a complete random lockers and stuff. It was so funny to watch because they just no one knew what on earth this stupid duck Man, was everywhere, but was we hoping. knew. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> right, right, right. No, and see, that's that yeah. is exactly what to do with yeah. starting your club, where it's like, like just choose a random mascot for your team. Right. Like want, the Chudley what's Cannons. That, what's that gorilla in Overwatch? You just want that guy's face and like a date yeah. and a room Winston. number. Winston. Oh yeah, just to put Winston's yeah. face? Winston's oh, man. face, date, room number, no other information. Put it 
at literally everywhere with no explanation, shoving in as many lockers as you can. People are going to be like, what is this? Yeah, and then you can start your marketing degree because that's there awesome. You go. Yeah, I would, I would <laughs> show You're up welcome. for that. welcome. Take, get yeah, grassroots the crap out of that school. Anyway, I think after our first game now, it's time for a, a word from our Patreon sponsor of the day. The sponsor of today's episode is Connor. This time, it's not a promposal. Have you ever wondered why Thanos needs all six Infinity Stones, or how Elsa got her powers? Or do you just need another YouTube channel to watch? Well, then you might want to check out Connor's YouTube channel at youtube.com backslash Connor Ricks. Link in the description down below. Hopefully. 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 The, yeah, the actual yeah. sponsor read includes hopefully. hopefully. Yeah. Like, <laughs> if they're for members. I you know guess. what? It's right. like, this is this is one of those, like, can I request this? Is this something I have power to do? <laughs> Answer is yes. It is yeah. something you have the power to do. If you'd ever like to sponsor one of our episodes here, you can do so by going to Patreon.com and becoming one of our $25 a month yeah. patrons. Patreon.com slash Gaming. That's the one right that there. Is, hey, that's the one. Way to include the important bits. Yes. Yep. People be like, I'm on the <laughs> Patreon. Patreon. Who do I give the Where money to? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So it sounds like he's a Connor must uh, tell us hello theorist. It sounds, it sounds like it because a couple of those theories sounded sounded interesting. They did, they yeah, did. No. We, we've investigated some ourselves. Alright. Indeed. Anyway, let's get on with the dragons. The dragons. Old, old Ender Wiggins here. Oh boy. Oh, Alright. Did you guys ever start any clubs? Did we st I never started a club. Although I remember in, so talking about clubs being discouraged, in my high school there was a guy, uh, Goofy Gordon, uh, and he wanted to start a uh, dodgeball club in our school. Oh man! And, yeah, the school was all like, I don't know about this, and it was like, what, what are you talking about? Uh, what, I, no one could really understand why they were being so weird about it, other than maybe they thought people were going to get hurt by dodgeballs. But like, oh. like one, you're you supposed it, to be. You dodging already ball, played it in gym, and the like. The enthusiasm from the student body was like immense because this is like when the movie Dodgeball came out. Oh really? Oh, oh that's yeah. pretty fun then. Yeah. Oh, oh the center ball. Oh really? Bender soul. Oh, How many people did did Dodgeball end up happening? Eventually, I. Honestly, it's such a it's such an annoying story because like it shouldn't be the sort of thing. It should be such a thing where the school nice. is like happy that one of their <gasps> students oh. wants to start a club and there's so much interest in it and they're all like, oh, I don't know if this is a good idea. And then I think literally like on the first day it finally happened, someone like broke the rank. <laughs> oh, oh no! Like, like, terrible, like oh, we told you, but it's like you didn't know. You just got lucky. Like you just got lucky. You, so got, you got lucky that somebody else didn't rank, get lucky. So, yeah. That's, that would, I feel like that would be me though, if I was the principal and it was like, I'm taking a huge risk here, but I'm gonna go ahead and allow this to happen. And then it would be like, first game. Yeah, that's yep, exactly yep, what that's, happened. That's, that <laughs> Yep. yep. Um, part of the course, really. <laughs> Derek, how about you, Better. you start a club? Um, not in high school, because in high school I was stupid. Uh, where like, I was like, no, I don't want to be a part of clubs. I don't want to do extracurricular activities. I'm too cool. Oh my that. God, I, I did all of the extracurricular uh, activities. I wish that I had. I'm not surprised I wish, if you are either we, going in high school or maybe like are a freshman, join every single extracurricular <coughs> activity that you can do. Yeah. Let well, me tell so, you. like, what did you do, Jordan? Um. I'm curious. Did you do like, because some of the clubs that were like in our high school, I had no idea what on earth they even were. Yeah. Like, they were called like Beta Club or Key Club, and it was like, what? what? So is I that? feel like all of the ones that I was in were fairly self-explanatory, or some of them had like um, abbreviations. So I, for sports, I did track, cross country, and soccer. Um, I was also in marching band and, or just band band um, and choir, which like were classes, but also kind of extracurriculars. Yeah. Um, I did Scholastic Bowl. Or oh, like, I've been boomed! Oh, oh no! no! Oh no! Now I'm out! I just had to sit and watch. Um, oh. Yeah, so I did Scholastic Bowl, which was like a. Come here. It's thing. coming to me! It's coming to me! And uh, <laughs> that was super duper fun. And I uh, was on the math team. And also oh, no! something called the WISE team. It was spelled oh, no. W Y S E. Um, and I don't really remember what it stood for. It was something <laughs> science and engineering. Oh, Which was your um, favorite of all of these? Probably Scholastic Bowl. Schola and, all right, and so what is the objective of Scholastic Bowl? Um, I, like, I'm thinking like Scholastic uh, book fairs. I got it! Um, <laughs> it was definitely like a quiz bowl team 
competition where you would compete against other schools in the area. Basically, they would ask like trivia questions. Man, I was trying to go for um, boom there. Oh, you're still really good at trivia. Yeah. I, oh, I, no! I, well, I think that I'm good at trivia, and then like the people that I play trivia with are just even better at trivia. I think that I that's literally just par for the course with trivia always. Yeah. Ben, do you want a ball or do you want a boom? Uh, I'll try to boom. All right, I'll try to ball. Okay. Okay. Great. Okay. Good, okay. Good there you go. Good we got to figure it out. Uh, I got going. Nobody, nobody's asked me which club <laughs> I started yet, which I'm, I'm not going to say I, I'm offended. But I like, thought, you know. did you, I what thought Derek's did you question was, did you guys? <coughs> yeah. I definitely, yeah. I definitely did do that. It's okay. Oh, I've been oh. boomed. Oh, the man? What? No, I've oh. been boomed. Oh, no, uh, Derek, Derek, you need Derek, to boom. You need to boom. Do it, Derek. Oh, do oh, the boom. Oh, I'm busy trying to not get scored on. Okay. Clear the ball then. Do oh, the boom. Oh, my goodness. Oh. Priorities, Derek. Oh, this is bad. Uh, in oh, fairness, no. Derek did ask, and then Jay answered, and I oh, just, I, I never felt like I missed the boom. Ah! No, I'm done. I missed the boom. Everything's awful. Ah! Oh, no! Oh, oh come on, I was there! I almost had it. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. This, this is not great. So much this is not great. Now, 1v3. Oh, jeez. So, Ben, what club did you start? When I was oh, in third oh, grade. Third grade, oh, boy. I started Animorphs Club. Yes! <laughs> yes! Animorphs. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> That's amazing! Oh, oh man! Yeah, yes. Ben, what would you do at Animorphs Club? Did you just pretend to be Animorphs or oh my God. the books? Or? Um, a little bit of everything, yeah. So, um, we did the, the Scholastic <laughs> Book Fair thing. Oh, oh, look, I think I literally teed this up for you guys. No. I'm so sorry! There's nothing that my boomless body can do. Oh, no, this is Derek just left all on his own. I don't know what to do. Bad. I uh, like this mode, first off. It's much more challenging. Uh, <laughs> that being said. I really wish I could play. <laughs> oh. Come here. Come here. Oh, it's so oh. hard to just sit here holding the controller doing absolutely nothing. <laughs> it is so hard. You Derek. got it, Derek. Yep. Yeah, no, it. buddy. Focus on the defense. I think the other thing that makes this. No! Gosh, it's so hard. It's so hard. The thing that makes it challenging is that the camera tracks to the ball, so you don't even always know where everybody yeah. else well, is. Yeah, well, I mean, you can turn it off, but then it's it's not. Not super oh easy. boy. It's not. Hmm. Yeah. So the Animorphs Club, Ben. Yeah, so yeah. Animorphs how, how Club. Long Animorphs. Yeah, so well, Animor Animorphs was basically like a book series that was out popular when I was a kid. Um, and so we would buy. Oh, I hit the ball! Look at me go. Um, we, I would buy like a whole bunch of them every time the Scholastic Book Fair would come around. So I had like 15 or 20 of them. Oh, and no. the oh, uh, no. the library in my third grade classroom did God. not. Like and you were about to boom Piper. For so sure. close. Uh, but the, the library in our classroom didn't have any, so I brought all mine in from home and stacked them up, and we had Animorphs Club, <laughs> and we would, like, raise money so that next time the book fair came along, we'd be able to buy more of them as uh, a group. Hey. Uh, which I think mostly, idea. literally, our meetings were oh, like, all right, guys, so when you get home, be sure to check under couch cushions, <laughs> see if there's anything you can do to raise the a couple extra quarters. Money raising idea. Um, oh, what a save! Oh, what a save! By what a Derek. save! No, that was the same by Ben. That was by me. I think we're not both of us. Yes, yeah. yes. MVP. You know, I'm doing what I can over here. 30 seconds oh, remaining. Yeah, if you could boom them, we could probably still come back. Um, What's the goal every two seconds? Oh, come on, I just split the difference oh, between the two of them. Oh, boy, here we go. Oh, yeah, booming, oh, they're still trying to... booming intentionally is really difficult. It's, it's not super easy. I, I don't even remember what the main character of Animorphs was, but what I do remember is that my third grade oh. crush... <gasps> Uh, Leslie Cook was Cassie, oh, yeah. who was like the love interest of the main character, and because mm -hmm. I started the club, I was the main, oh, character. So and so the main character. I, I never told anybody, but right, I was absolutely right. using the situation to my right. advantage when right. I play Animorphs at recess. Yeah, home. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> oh my god. I gotta we, say. We got destroyed, it turns literally. out. Literally. Yeah. So Guys. third grade crush Cassie. Oh. If you're watching. Well, Ka Cassie was the, the in, oh. in book name. Her name is Leslie Cook. So Ben's third grade crush Leslie. If so you're yes, watching, yes. drop, a, drop, drop a comment. Let us yeah. know. It's probably too late. May, we may have. <laughs> <laughs> that ship might have sailed. <laughs> <laughs> probably. Oh my gosh, was that the first game or the second game? That was, that the, was, second the, game. was the second game. Oh. That was a very long game. Oh man, okay, me. well, we're still, so far this uh, new rules have resulted in far fewer wins.
Yeah, uh, yeah, 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 that was not guys, great. We are, we're not even above the fold right now. Derek, thanks for man in the man in the fold. We're tied with someone who's above charge, the fold. man. My goodness. What's even worse is that the evil Sky Corp is actually in front of us. No, I think for the first time man. ever. We're losing to the Sky Corp. Probably because oh, we lost by like three hundred points last game. Oh, that that maybe is doing it. Yeah, yeah we're we're yeah. the worst of the two and two teams. Yeah, I think so. I know uh, my seventh grade soccer team just gloating up there. So, the oh man, four now. I think the main takeaway from today's episode is uh, one, start an Animorphs club. <laughs> uh, two, make up uh, really awesome grassroots flyers that uh, are very vague but will invite lots of attention. And right. put them literally everywhere and don't ask anyone ahead of time, just do it. Date, time, and place is all you need. Date, time, place, gorilla. There you go. People are going to be like, I am curious. I need to know more. Need to But know. if you know the game, you'll know exactly what that is. Exactly. You know, like. Exactly. So make it so that if you're in the know, you know. But if you're not in the know, you're curious to be in the know. Yeah. So you show up, you know. Right, uh, right, right. You know? There you go. You should also be in on it. So, like, be part of the buzz. Be like, have you guys seen these gorilla posters everywhere? What is the deal? Yeah, like, yeah. like, don't quietly sit there. Like, I would actively be bringing the right. conversation up in right. every class. Like, sit down and be like, guys, gorilla posters. Yeah. And you gotta be pretty sneaky about, like, putting them up, though. Like, you don't wanna be seen doing it. You don't no, want people sure. to know it's you. Right. Right. People are just gonna show up, and then you're gonna be like, welcome, everyone. I've invited you to my video game club and they'll be like, oh fun, or like, oh, okay. Also, if you put up posters and take pictures, please send them to us. Yes. <laughs> yes. We will feature them here I would on the like channel. to see oh, that. It's sure. Gorilla Gorilla Marketing. Oh yes, oh, it is Gorilla. Yes, yes. Yes, this, is, this is Gorilla Gorilla Marketing, which is the best kind of marketing. Oh man, I'm so excited. I hope it works. I want to know how it turns out. Please give us an update at some point in the future. But until next time, Chug the cannons, Chug the cannons, boom, 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 we are not pirates.